Hi everyone, I'm Jeannie. And I'm Elisa, we are from App Raider and we are back. But today we're gonna to talk about app screenshots. They're super important that you make a good first impression for the people that are looking at the app store and looking through your app store listing. They convince users that they'll download your apps and we're gonna go over all the reasons why they're so, so, so crucial to your app success. So here are six tips to create awesome app screenshots. Let's jump into it. All right, first tip of <laughs> Okay. All right, first tip of this video is to show off what can your app do? What are your USPs? What are USPs, you ask me? Unique selling point, which means what makes your app different than other apps? This is exactly what you should be putting in your screenshots so people know right away what they're gonna get when they download your app. <laughs> Second tip, describe your main features. So use the screenshots to show the purpose of your app. What is your main feature that you're giving the users? When I scroll over the screenshots, the only thing that I want to see is actually what is this app doing? So I don't know, I want an app to help me with filters. So I want to see which filters you have. So use your app screenshots to highlight your main features. And don't forget, your first screenshot is the most important ones. So your main feature should be there. Our third trip. <laughs> I would like to take a trip. <laughs> okay. Our third tip is that your screenshots should not only be static images, but they should build a story. So with the screenshot slots that you have, for example, in the app store, you can give up to 10 screenshots, which is quite a lot of space. You want to use every single slot to build a storyline about how the user is going to go through your app. So you're showing them the user journey that they should expect once they download your app. Make it something exciting make it something appealing and make sure that you keep your target audience in mind. Language matters! And then you should just spit out some Portuguese. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> <laughs> That's exactly how I speak Portuguese. I'm not so fast. That's Portuguese. <laughs> Fourth point language matters. Make sure you speak the language of your users. If you offer your app in different languages, don't forget about your screenshots. So usually you have some tags on top of your screenshots and you should use in the language that your app is available. So for instance, I'm from Brazil, I speak Portuguese, and if I see the screenshots are in Portuguese, I'll be more willing to download it because it's my mother language. So really, language matters. So our fifth tip, my favorite topic, branding. <laughs> You want to stay on brand. You've chosen a couple colors, you have a color scheme, you have some typography that you use, a specific font that you use within your app as well, maybe also on your website. Keep to the theme that you've already chosen. Don't go super, super crazy in your app store listing because then people aren't going to easily recognize your app brand. Now, when you stay with the same color scheme and the same fonts, then your app brand becomes stronger and more recognizable. And then you increase the brand awareness, not only within the app stores, but also outside of it. Nice. Branding! <laughs> Sixth tip of the day, design and orientation. So, your screenshot should be landscape or portrait, remember? Landscape? No, portrait? Remember, portrait or landscape? Well, it depends on your app. If you have a game, usually you play like this, so your screenshot should always be like this. But if you're talking about the Instagram or Facebook, you're not going to use landscape. Your screenshots should always communicate with how your app usage is. Don't overload it. So not a lot of tags, a lot of overlay images. Keep it simple. Simple is good. Simple is nice. Thanks for joining us, guys. That's it for today. We hope that you like this video. And we know how hard it is to deal with screenshots. Because, you know, it's holiday season, it's Christmas, and you want to upload different screenshots. But then you have for iOS different formats, and for each language and each format, oh my god, it's a mess. So, Jeannie, how can we make this process more efficient? I have the perfect answer. With App Radar, you'll be able to upload all of your screenshots at once for all of your localizations, meaning countries or app storefronts, in one click. So, enough with the spending hours and hours and hours and hours iterating your uploading and then waiting for it to upload. You just do it in a zip file all at once in our 
App Store optimization tool, and then you'll get an email or notification that the upload is done and that it's ready to be published. And ta-da! And that's amazing, and you can try it out for free. Just go to the link in our description and try it out. Create your free account. And don't forget, for more app tips and app marketing tricks, follow us on all of our Instagrams. We have a lot of Instagrams. <laughs> we have a lot of, you know, like Genie's, mine, Thomas, and an operator. Mm -hmm. It's a lot. Follow us on all of our social media. We're going to link them all in the description box down below. We have Instagram, Facebook, LinkedIn, and Twitter. And of course, YouTube. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. Hit the notification bell so you get a notification every single time we release a video. I think I pointed there, but the subscribe button is here. Oh, I, I don't know where it is. It's here. Subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. So we'll see you next time with more tips for you. If you like this video or if you want to hear more tips, just comment. We're happy to hear from you. And wait, give us a thumbs up. Oh, Hit yeah. Give that thumbs oh, yeah. up, guys. And now, bye.